we're actually planning to sue and everything, but I'm actually been advised that you know what, those are they thrive in. Uh, in that kind of news. Now, welcome to the entertainment channel. I go by the name of Jemu More. Kama Kawaide, if you are new here, please subscribe to my channel. And if you appreciate my content, you can go ahead and push the like button. Hello, motherfucker. <laughs> yes, now today we're going to talk about Langata MP Felix Odor, aka Jalango, who has come forward to talk about the whole slander alcohol. Now, this is Jalango by the alcohol trend because it was being alleged that he's part of the 1 billion gold scam kunule mse think ni mse wa tunisia ama mse wa wapi alikuwa karibu kuko ni around 1 billion na watu walikuwa alikuwa na fake what that they have real gold that wana takuza na ibiz by the way tena because a lot of people wana kwa account na hii story ya gold now jalango ilikuwa alleged na alikuwa trend by the way on social media that is among the people who yeah wako ndani hii katel hii katel ya kuuza gold na jalango ali respond to hiyo kitu i think ilikuwa post hiyo kwa citizen weekly kuna hii gazeti na jita citizen weekly that it had alleged ilikuwa ni jalango niliona hapo alanche sang and you know ule kuna ile ule ex wa ambare ule something hata ni jahir zanda i think anakonga mp kule kisi but anyway jalango alikuwa among the people that walikuwa na ilikuwa alleged that he's among that scam of conning people you know with fake gold and jalango alikuwa actually alikuwa me post kwa his social media after alchika me trend and said that he would actually sue ah uh, see because yo kitu na kutafulia jina because when people say that you are part of a cartel that is you know conning people na wewe labda una, una run biz legit mpaka eh, ujitete njalanga hoteli alcomenda on his instagram alikona sema that he will sue them but it seems like he has changed his mind for you know one reason or another that you posted on your insta story about yes. defamatory uh, issue yes. can you talk about uh, so i woke up the other day and uh, citizen weekly mm. in their everyday way decided to write that uh, I am part of a one billion. Can you imagine one billion? Yeah. If I had one billion, what would I still be doing? So it is very sad that uh, we have rogue media that can just wake up. You know, media built me to where I am. Uh, we were actually planning to sue and everything, but I'm actually been advised that, you know what, those are, they thrive in, uh, in that kind of news. Yeah. Everybody was telling me, just sue them, just sue them. But then I realized they've written bad stories about everyone. But it's not true. As we do honest business, we work hard, and we've always lived to integrity. So yes. No way you're involved in I'm that. No, I'm not. I'm not even involved. I don't even know where the story is. When you read the story, that's when you realize there's no story in it. It's just a topic for people to buy the magazine. Mm -hmm. Yes. But you, uh, you said they are, they are looking for you. They are calling you. There are few of them who are calling. He was actually interviewed on uh, Mongai Eve, where he talked about why he doesn't want to, you know, basically you know sue the uh, citizen weekly because initially alikuwa amesema atawasu sasa yeye anasema he will not sue them because at hiyo ndio tabia yao at hiyo citizen weekly ni wase tu wa kuchafulia watu jina apparently citizen weekly na ulio mimi hata sijaisikia mimi hata nimeza kusikia juzi but citizen weekly apparently apparently ni watu wa marumas they like you know kuchafulia watu jina and jalango alikuwa among the alikuwa ni 3m 3m kulikuwa na jalango kulikuwa na ule senator anajita Alan Chesang alafu kulikuwa na ule ex wa ambare u ex wa ambare this is not the first time tunasikia hii ex wa ambare kuna hiyo history history anakujanga mara mingi mara mingi jina yake nafina kitolewa so maybe eh, maybe ako ako ndani hiyo kitu but for, for jalango in in mara pili and every time it has come up so nakumkasikile ile ngine edgar kama amemnini on uh, bnn edgar kama jaribu ku expose hata na sasa hiyo story ilikuwa ni juu nini because Edgar Gobare pia alikuwa majaribu ku expose that he's part of a certain cartel that cons people Jalango akatokea akasema that he makes his business legit and personally na believe Jalango I don't think Jalango anafanya nga business chafu you can know, the way although he do the way he presents himself he presents himself like he's he's doing legit business na hata ukiona kwa hiyo interview he seems to be you know ana anaongea nye ukweli maybe the, maybe it's because he associates with these people because pia unaona ngoma picha zake na hawa tu anaita ngoma cartel unaona ni mabeste mabeste wake which uh, I, i don't know if if you can say just because somebody associates with somebody who is you know in that cartel that you automatically say that he is you know part of the cartel kuna watu tu mnajua anga tu hivyo hivyo Eh, kama wewe ni mtu wa shash na labda una associate na mtu avuti shash 
watu watasumeni mtu wa shash lakini uh, eh labda tu tunasociate tuna, unaenanga pale mamoshi zinakupitia anga sisi tunavutanga uh, kuna kuna watu wako hivyo maybe he associates with these people but he is not in, in that business so personally i feel like uh, uh, so far I, i don't think there's any evidence solid evidence that shows that jalango is part of this cartel mkiniuliza So far hakuna mtu amekuja na evidence everything is just rumors hakuna mtu amekuja na hard evidence kama ile ya Ambare who ah who ex Ambare don't say there's a belief because the, the guy likes likes flaunting a lot of money out of jangi business yake ni gani jamaa tu anatonishanga pesa tu anatonishanga pesa we don't know any business he does so na kuna hizo rumors by this zimekuwa kimfuata here jalango it's something very recent I think the only pa- other person that I'm claiming ni nani Edgar of which Edgar date letter ni ni evidence he, he, Edgar actually is his yake tu ni anasema he's guilty by association which is you know, that is not enough evidence kusema mtu ana nini anafanya biz gani mm tabuku nje watu wana associate na watu wanafanya vibaya na hata nyinyi maybe mtu na hangout na yeye ni mwizi na ujuangi sasa kumoja atashiku wanze kwambe pia ni mwizi na you just associate na na mse tu kama vile nimekuambia kuna, kuna watu wana associate na watu wa mashashi watu, watu kama sisi watu wa mashashi lakini eh yeah, kazi yake tu na kujanga beza na kujanga tu second hand second hand smoke mimi najua mabesi yangu wengine ni nyingi kishashi lakini sasa jua na hangout na mimi inabidi tu Yeah, lakini wewe sema jamaa kwa guilty by association. Kama hizi utangi fegi na, na kuna mabesi yangu anakutanga fegi. Sasa wewe sema mimi nakutanga fegi sababu mabesi yangu anakutanga fegi. Mm, I, I think that is just assumption. I think you know the situation jalango yuko but anyway, tell me in the comment section what you think about the story, what you think about easy allegations because uh, this is the second time jalango may come out and personally I, I don't believe jalango is part of this thing. I think ni kuwekelewa tu anaekelewa wangu tu. I don't think he is really into that business but anyway, tell me in the comment section what you think about the story. Also remember to follow me on Instagram at jemomore.ke ni kwa TikTok sahi and at jemomore ni kwa TikTok. Endo watch videos zangu, uzi like and I'll see you in the next one.